Alrighty, hello guys, so can face this back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks, and today we are back in our Hardcore Career Mode series. Today we are actually going to be adding some boat controls to our airplane right here, because at the minute we have no control once we are actually in the water, uh, and that's a really big issue. That is, that is a huge issue. So, we're going to go ahead and put some boat controls in this thing today. We also actually had an engine fire recently as well, so we need to come up with an idea to fix that. And um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do that today. So let's see if we can uh, we can do the boat controls first, and then we'll see if we can do the coolant, and we'll go from there. Okie dokie. So not much needs to actually happen here. I am gonna make them out of electricity. So um, wait, actually we could use these. No, we we we're not gonna use those. Okay, right. Um, propeller. Do, 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 do. In fact, actually we could use one of those. We could use one of those. So instead of this being like full throttle or whatever. We can actually attach it to up and down, and that will be our boat control. Uh, same with this one. Hey, there we go. All right, good. Boat controls are in. <laughs> That's it. That's it. We're done. We did it. Okay, good. Um, with that being said, we also need a rudder. So let's go ahead and whack a rudder in here somewhere. I don't know where it would go. I don't know where a rudder would go. Um, oh, I really don't know where a rudder would go. Uh, maybe just slap it on the side and that'll be fine. Rudder. Here we go. So grab one of these. There we go. Grab it in the right color, which is this, and smack it straight onto here. That's fine. There we go. So that's going to go around there like that, I guess. That's fine. Go to the other side and delete it. Put it on there instead. There we go. And I think that's the right way around, which it is. All right, fantastic. So they're going to control or be controlled with your or whatever. That is actually fine. Uh, in fact, actually, what are these controlled by? Let's have a little look at that first. So these guys are controlled by this. Okay, that's fine. Uh, it could just be another control assembly for that, and that'll be okay. All right, very good. It also means I have to do less work, which is always good. So we go attach those guys together. Fantastic. All right, there are other things that we also need to do. We need to be able to refuel our actual uh, tank, because at the minute we can't. <laughs> so we're going to add a refueling port for that on both sides, I would imagine, uh, and that'll be fine. Should I put it on the top or the bottom? I actually don't know. Um, Alright, delete this. There we go. Uh, we'll have two. That's okay. Hose. Yes. Okay. Uh, it's going to be like brown. I guess that's fine. We'll whack it in right there. That's okay. And we'll bring it in and push it to the side. And that should be great. Here we go. Whack that in there. Fluid port. Let's do it. Yes. And now we should be able to refuel our aircraft. That's fantastic. That's actually really good. Um, right, now that we've done that, everything that we've got works. Uh, we would like some coolant for our engines. Like, a little bit of a better coolant, because at the minute we've got a radiator, but we don't have anything else. So, hmm, I don't know what to do there. Alright, what I might do, uh, which might make things look a little bit ugly, but we'll see. So we're gonna cut this and we're gonna put it there instead. Okay, that's pretty weird, but it's fine. We're then gonna get a tank, okay, and this is gonna be like a tank of water. Uh, or whatever. So that's gonna go there like that. There we go. Fantastic. We're gonna put that there like that and these guys are both gonna be fresh water. There we go. So that should introduce a lot of cooling because uh, it's fresh water. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and whack these guys onto here as well. Bam. There we go. Good. And we're gonna smack these guys onto here also. There we go. And merge them together. There we go. Great. So that's that one done. We now need to do these ones. Uh, so let's grab this. Bring it down. Yes. There we go. Paste it there. And put the uh, the tanks in here as well. That'd be great. Here we go. Tank. Make it this color. Spin it around. Whack it in. There we go. Brilliant. Um, there we go. Fresh water and fresh water. And merge them together. Here we go. Bam, bam. Excellent. Right. Grab the yellow. Go ahead and smack this under here. Do that across the bottom. And on this side, we're going to do... Why is it white? There we go. Do this. All right. Fantastic. There we go. So everything is merged, uh, I do believe. That's good. And everything should work, which is is also good. Um, oh, these haven't been moved down. Oh, that's really annoying when that happens. Okay, let me do these ones real quick. And then we've pretty much done everything we need. So that's good. All right, if you guys are liking this video so far, make sure to actually like it down below. That'll help me out massively. And consider subscribing too to see more videos like this one. Alright guys, I've done it. I've actually done it. So we just need to merge this with this. There we go. And that is everything done. So our cooling should be a lot better now. Also, temp. Uh, we should grab one of these and actually smack it into each of the engines. 
because at the minute we can't really tell uh, what our temperature is. So we need that. There we go. Uh, if I can put this in there, that'd be great. Why can't I? How big is this thing? It's tiny. Why can't I put it in there? What? Why? What is going on? Is this like part of a wall? What is this? Why is this here? Go away. Wait, what is that? What is it supposed to be? I don't, I don't think that should be there. I, I don't think any of that should have been there. What is this? What are these things? I'm confused. All right, there we go. Well, we've deleted those. That's fine. That's now got a temperature sensor. This guy is going to have a temperature sensor too. There we go. And instead of using the temperature from these guys, we're going to use the temperature from these guys because that just makes sense. So, um, yeah, let's do that. So this guy is straight into here. This guy is straight into here. There we go. Uh, this one, straight into wherever this one is. Hey, there we go. Good. And then this one, straight into this one. And that should be perfect. All right, let's go. Let's do our mission. Also, some of you guys said that we should have um, the ability to move our wings. So, like, to fold them back up. Unfortunately, if we did fold the wings back up, we would have more issues than, than enough. <laughs> um, and the reason being, uh, the reason we'd have issues with that is because... Oh, hang on. Um, is because the center of mass would actually be really high. Uh, and that's not a very good idea. So, there you go. Anyway, let's do this and this. I'm actually just going to throttle these up to try and get us off the wall. There we go. And I'm going to thr throttle them all down. Turn them all on. Okay. Go ahead and press 2 and 6 at the same time. 3, 2, 1, go! There we go. Press 2 again. Press 6 again. And we are airborne. Excellent. I should have probably tested out the uh, <laughs> the boat capabilities first. Actually, let's do that. Alright, here we go. We're going to land in the water. I'm just going to turn these off. I fled it at the wrong time, but that's okay. So we're going to land it in the water. There we go. And if I want to go backwards... Is it working? It's very slow, but it is... It is working. I think. Okay, uh, our rudders are actually the wrong way around, too. The, the little rudders on the sides, they're actually the opposite of where they should be. Oh, uh, that's really annoying. Okay, um, I might make all of those all of those motors actually work uh, towards this goal. We'll see, though. Right, here we go. Okay, so we're in the sky. We're going to turn ourselves around. We're going to fly back. We can't do this too much because we're running out of fuel, and that's an issue. How much fuel do we actually have left? One eight hundred. Yeah, that's not an awful lot of fuel. We're going to struggle here. We, we are going to struggle, but we'll see. Um, so no turning on the engines. We just got to fix these um, these motors, fix the rudders, and we'll be good to go. Okay, let's do it. So um, motors. Do, 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 do. Let's go ahead and connect those to there. There we go. So one and two. There we go. Fantastic. One and two. Excellent. That's good. We now need to invert these guys because they're currently wrong. There we go. Paste that in there. Merge it together. Fantastic. Go to the other side. Do the same thing. Here we go. So grab this. Cut it. Flip it. Turn it around. Paste it. Merge it. And we're good to go. There we go. All right. So we should have enough power now that we actually have all of these working. Um, hopefully that'll be good. Maybe. Because I, I don't have any bigger motors. That's that's the biggest motor I have. Um, we should probably have a generator on this thing as well, like an APU. But uh, we don't. We don't have one. So never mind. We also don't really have the fuel for one. So... There you go. Anyway, let's go ahead and get inside, get it going, and um, refuel ourselves. Let's see if our propeller works first, though. Our boating stuff. Yeah, I mean, it moves us. It is... It is moving us. And it is turning us. Okay, so we can move, we can turn. I think I'm happy with that. That works. All right, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Two and six. There we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so we got to fly over to the target, uh, which is actually the uh, the refinery. There we go. And uh, we got to we gotta refuel ourselves. We have quite a lot of money. Um, I don't think we should spend all of our money on diesel, but we might have to. We'll see. 
Anyway, let's get over there and see what happens. Guys, I, I, I've done a boo-boo. Uh, I've done a big boo-boo. We can't turn around now because we don't have enough fuel to do so, but um, we uh, we made a big boo-boo. I, I th these are connected. I just think the uh, the temperature sensor actually needs some electricity. Uh, and unfortunately, we didn't give it any. So, um, yeah, these dials all read zero. And that is our temperature. So it's kind of important. It is kind of, kind of important. But never mind, I guess. <laughs> never mind. Also, our battery is not recharging. That's also a big issue, but, um, whatever. I guess it's fine. <laughs> it's probably fine. Maybe. I don't know. You know, actually, being able to reverse the collective would be amazing, because then we wouldn't have to use motors to go forwards and backwards. We could just use the propellers to do that, but um, that would also be a lot more tricky to do. So I, I am kind of glad we've used motors instead. Um, but we're going to have to land this thing so that we can actually get pretty close to the, uh, to the, the, the crane. And unfortunately, that means coming in from the, this side uh, and then reversing inwards. Um, which might be very tricky to do. So, I'm currently drifting the, uh, the entire aircraft. Here we go. We're going down and in. Alright, we need to press three in a second. Here we go. Alright, three. We've turned our engines off. Alright, I needed to do that way sooner, but never mind, that's fine. Here we go. We are down. And now I need to reverse. And I don't think we're strong enough to do so while it's wavy. I don't think we are. Are we? Are we going backwards? Uh, maybe the waves will actually help us here. We'll see. Um, so there you go. Alright, good. I'm going to go ahead and turn off all the engines. Although I could keep them running. Oh, I could keep them running. Just to save on battery power. Because like, we won't be able to turn them back on. If I, if I run out of battery here, we've, we've got issues. Uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Because if that goes down and dies, that's an issue. What do I do? What do I do? We're running out of fuel pretty quickly. Uh, how much do we have left? 900. Okay. I'm going to turn this off. Okay. I've turned it off. That is maybe a bad move, maybe not a bad move, we'll see. I'm going to go to sleep, and hopefully in the morning it will be less wavy. I've researched large boats, that's good. New mission, no waves, no waves, no waves. That's really, like, a lot of waves. That's like no waves. Okay, right, we got no waves now. It is dark, but we got no waves. Okay, how much power do we have? Oh, this is an issue. Okay. So, we want to go that way. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use our propellers to do it. We can't have this go down too far. So, we need to watch out for that. Nah, it's not going to work out that way. It's not going to work that way. Okay. So, what do we need to do? Uh, I'm going to drop my fire extinguisher. I'm going to grab a rope. Should I grab a rope? No, maybe a hose. We'll grab the hose from upstairs. And I'm going to have to just try and drag it backwards. Although I don't know if that's going to work. A bigger winch would have been way better. But I don't have the bigger winch unlocked yet either. So, problems. Um, but hopefully I can drag this thing. Uh, I'm not sure I can, but we'll see. Okay, uh, we got to try something different. we got to try something different. Alright, start this engine and this engine. Okay, we've pointed ourselves towards the target. Okay, we're now going to go ahead and lower that to zero. Okay, we're now going to turn on all the engines.
Okay. We're bringing ourselves closer. Okay. We are... We're, we're at the... <laughs> we're at the limit of where we can actually be. Okay, right. Engine's off. Okay, excellent. Uh, we're going to get outside and we're going to see if our hose connector can actually reach now. Okay, open this up. I'm just going to worry about pulling this out in a second, but that's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry too much. All right, there we go. Close this up. Okay, excellent. You guys probably can't see very much right now, but neither can I, so don't worry about it too much. All right, here we go. Jump across onto the shore. Oh, come on. Okay, up here we go. Yes. Okay, fantastic. Ah, I fell off. Come on, I need to get up there. Hopefully you guys can see at least a little bit of what's going on here. So I'm trying to climb onto the shore. Okay, which is difficult in itself. Is, is those meteors? There's no way meteors are striking right now. Okay. Okay. I, I, I don't know what to do. There's meteors striking over there in the distance. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I can't get towards... I can't get to there. I can't get to where I need it to get to. It's like so close, but so far away. That's really annoying. Also, there's going to be a big wave coming in a second. Uh, What do I do? That's not 45 meters, is it? There's no way that's 45 meters. Let's have a little look. So select this. 37. I, I feel like we should be able to get to there, but we can't. Um, What else do I do? What do I do? We're going to run out of fuel, we're going to run out of electricity, and we're going to be stuck here forever. That's not what I want. Um, but this is the jet one, and that's the diesel one right there. Issues. Ah, oh, big old issues. Okay. Okay, hang on. Can I have this winch out? Oh, no, that is actually the length of the winch. That's really, really bad. Okay. Uh, what is that over there? That's weird. Um, right. There must be something we can do. We can buy diesel. Right, we can buy diesel there. This is here. We're running out of fuel everywhere. I can buy fuel from somewhere else first, I suppose. Um, yeah. I mean, I can buy fuel from there, but that's miles away. Uh, I don't know what to do. I, the, the, I can't really do much here, which is an issue. Um... What do I do? Oh yikes 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 yikes! No 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 Oh no 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 Okay I was expecting this but I wasn't expecting it right now Oh yikes Oh yikes 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 Where's my plane? Please don't be upside down Oh it's just gonna turn around Okay that's not actually that bad But I am underwater I do have an oxygen mask that is actually extremely lucky, but, uh, oh, <laughs> hey, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm all right. Okay. Whew. Okay. Uh, can we lift off in the amount of time that we, or the amount of space we have? Probably. Uh, do we have enough? Mm, oh, this is annoying. This is really annoying. Okay. We survived another, another tsunami slash rogue wave. That's good. However, we shouldn't have to. Anyway, press three. Okay, how much fuel have I got? 830, okay. Okay. Bear with me, guys. We're gonna do something stupid. We're gonna do something stupid! Okay, so we got 850. We're gonna fly back to our base, which is just down here. I'm gonna build something real quick, and then we're gonna fly back, and hopefully that'll be okay. It might be. It might not be. We might not have enough fuel to do this. Actually, we do. Because we got fuel stored down there, too. Okay, this is going to be okay. Maybe. Unless our engines overheat, which in that case, it's not going to be okay. But we'll, uh, we'll see what happens. Right, here we go. Let's do this, this, and this, and this, and this. There we go. Landing lights actually don't need to be on. Let's turn those off. And off we go. Brilliant. Okay. We got this, guys. We got this. All right, guys. Here we go. We're coming in for a landing. And now, we don't have to land too close, but uh, we should be able to refuel from here because it is it is close to the edge. Uh, we're going to go ahead and turn this thing off. All right, here we go. We're going to glide ourselves in. 
In fact, turn it on a little bit. There we go. Okay, we're going to go a little bit closer to the actual hangar itself. Okay, what are we doing? I've turned it around by accident. Okay, hang on. Throttle this one up and this one up. There we go. Press 2. There, okay. I need to put that on push. Uh, or like a push button thing, because at the minute it's not working out the way that I want it to. Anyway, this is fine. We are close enough. This is okay. So, what my idea is, uh, is I'll build something that uh, allows us to actually use this thing properly. So, what I mean by that is, we're going to close this up. Drop that on the ground, that's okay. Let's go over there. I'm going to build. It's going to be so simple, you guys are going to be like crazy. You're going to love it. Um... And we're going to use it here first, because we actually need to, so that's a thing. Anyway, um, let's go and build it. Right, ready? Ready how crazy this thing's going to be? Hose. Okay, here we go. Hose. There we go. Hose. Pipe. Uh, in the middle. Here we go. Uh, one of... I guess we'll have an enclosed straight pipe. There we go. Uh, and realistically, actually, I want all of this to be, like, orange, so that we can actually see it. So, very orange. Bam. There we go. Excellent. So this is just a pass-through pipe, so we can have a bunch of hose on this side, a bunch of hose on this side, and it should allow it to flow through the middle, which would be brilliant. Also, I'm going to add a handle to this, because I'm not sure you can pick up hose bits. But there you go. Right. Let's want it in. It floats. That's good. We're going to connect this to here. There we go. Connect that to there. Okay, fantastic. In fact, actually, we're going to have to pull this out first and attach it to the plane, aren't we? We are. All right, let's do the plane, plane side first, please. In fact, I can just do it from here. Right, so we grab this. There we go. We grab this guy. Turns out it's hard to, it's hard to just grab this. All right, here we go. We swim it out to the aircraft. We then attach it on, we then lower the winch down, which should lower this out, and then we can connect it together, and hopefully we can refuel with this. If we can, that's awesome. If we can't, we might have to put a pump in line, but we'll see. So put that there. Attach this to this winch. There we go. And then winch out. Then grab this, and uh, we'll take it in. Actually, we need the hose as well. Give me that hose. There we go. Okay, good. Give me this. And let's go! Okay, is this gonna work? <laughs> I'm hoping this works. I'm hoping this works. But we don't have to take it too far, we just need to get it as far as we can. And then we'll, um, we'll attach our new hose to it, and we'll see if that works. Also, the fact that this doesn't float might be an issue, but we'll see. Alright, I've attached the second hose, and I'm trying to swim it, uh, up to here. Okay, let go of this. Let's go, I'm trying to swim it, so that we can get it in and connect it onto the thing. If we can, that's great. If we can't, I'm going to cry. I feel like it's going to be so close, but we'll see. All right, here we go. Ladder, let's go. Yes. Okay, and connect it on to... Pump in, pump out. There. Pumping out. Okay. I feel like this is the way it works. I feel like these are the wrong way around, though, aren't they? Because that looks like it's in, but that's pump in. And then that looks like it's out, but that's pump out on that side. Weird. I don't get it. Anyway, 11,600. Let's go ahead and uh, turn the one on on the plane, and we'll see if this actually works. Because it might. It might also not work. We'll see. Okay, so currently zero. Still zero. That's not doing anything. No. We need a faster... I don't know what's going on here. I don't know whether I need an inline pump. I'm not sure. I feel like this should be working, though. But it's not. Hmm. Hmm. Wait, actually, is this, like, pump pump in to, like, the vehicle? Or is this pump pump out of the vehicle? Okay, that makes more sense. That makes a hell of a lot more sense. 
Um, wait, uh, what have I? What was this before? <laughs> have I taken fuel out? Is that what I've done? I think I might have just taken all the fuel out. That's an issue. Yep, it's zero. We took all the fuel out. That's not what we want. That's not what we want at all. Okay, so go ahead and close this up. We don't want to refuel this bit anyway, so that's fine for now. Um, but we do want to refuel our actual fuel tank, so let's do that real quick. We need to get over there. We need to empty this into our plane. Please work. Please work. Okay, so the emptying worked. So let's do this one and this one. I mean, it looks like it's putting some in, but also it's taking 10 years to do it. It's taking so long to do it. Let's go see if it's actually refueling. Would you look at that? Oh, it is. It is actually refueling. Okay, so we're going to have to just sit here for a few uh, few hours uh, until that refuels at least to about, let's say, like 3,000. I want 3,000 liters of fuel on there. Um, and then we can go. So, uh, yeah, that'll be fine. I just got to wait and uh, that'll be okay. All right, cool. Okay, so I was just sat here, right? I was just sat here because it's going to take forever to actually do. And uh, look what happened. Uh, yeah. Oh, I'm getting sucked under. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Okay. I'm going to die? What is happening? What has happened to the game? What? What do I do? No! This is stupid! This is so d I can't even get onto the plane because it's too high out of the water. Uh, what? Oh, I'm so annoyed right now. I am so annoyed right now. It's back to 10,600 liters, which, um, okay, that's fine. What in the world, though? What? Is what do I do? I, I can't get onto the aircraft. It's too high. I might need to get a boat out there, but I- I- Where's the wings gone? Okay, well, I'm upset. I'm very upset. Uh, and there's not much I can do about it. So, there you go. Anyway, uh, I'm going to end this video here. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think I should do here. Um, see you next time. Goodbye.